for a multi-year extension of lease of real property for the Office of the Prosecuting Attorney in Kona. A fourth extension of lease would be authorized for a two-year period. This year's rent would be $12,295.92 per month, and the second year's rent would be $12,690.02 per month, introduced by Ms. Eoff. Thank you. We have a motion. Motion to approve Resolution 432. Second. What's that, Ms. David? Oh, Ms. Poindexter. Moved by Ms. Poindexter, second by Mr. Paleka. Um, Mr. Roth is at the table. Council members, if there are any questions. Um, Mr. Roth, I don't have any questions here. Did you want to contribute some information, or shall we just go vote on this? Uh, I'd be happy if you just voted on it. Thank you very much for taking this first, though. Okay, it's very self-explanatory, and I thought it would go fast. So, um, This is for an extension for two more years, correct? That is correct. Okay, and, and then my, my question is, why aren't you folks making it like a longer term instead of just um, two years? Because I'm thinking, building if, well, 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 let me finish my question. So, because I'm thinking, if you make it a longer term, then you might be able to get like, a, uh, I guess, a lesser rent per month. The uh, new judiciary building will be built in Kona, I believe, in the next two years. When that happens, we'll be moving from Captain Cook to the West Hawaii campus, uh, and so our our office uh, will be built at the same time. So. Rather than having deputies driving 45 minutes to court um, or half an hour for court back and forth from traffic, they'll be in the new office, uh, which hopefully, God willing, will be at the same time in two years at the, the uh, West Hawaii just, just Building is built. So, so what you're saying is that you're anticipating or you know that your office building going to be built within the two years? We are anticipating, I, as you recall, the, um, there was funds that the council has put forward for uh, the building. We are currently, I believe, uh, Public Works is working with the architects. Um, and my understanding is everything is moving forward with our building and everything is moving forward with the West Hawaii Judiciary Building. Okay, so no, um, but this is for your office space, right? The prosecutor's office space, correct? Correct. Okay, so... Correct. So do you have the funds or you, or we just gave you an appropriation to build the, to complete the, the prosecutor's office? Um, I, Deanna Sacco is coming up. I believe that we, the funds have been approved for the building. I, I believe we had a, uh, a bond that was taken out a couple of years ago. Hi, Deanna Sacco, Director of Finance. Um, the funding that was provided was for the design of the building. And then uh, we will need to come back to you guys once the design is complete to know what the ex actual construction cost is for uh, an additional bond at that time. Okay, so to me, fiscally responsible, as was mentioned earlier before, and then, you know, like we were looking at creating a new department. I mean, if, if we know, like, say, it might take, like, another four more years to get this um, office building done for the prosecutors, wouldn't it be better just to negotiate with this landowner or this owner of this building for that four years with an option of maybe if the building is built, then we can, you know, I guess um, uh, be recused from the, the contract, but then also maybe getting a better term per month because then, this first year going to be like $12,295 per month. Then in the second year, it goes up to $12,690. So almost like a $400 increase per month for the second year. And so if it's possible, we can keep the cost down. That would be great for the county. Um, yes, we hear what you're saying, but at the same time, I think Public Works is very well aware that they need to get prosecutors into the new space um, by the time the judiciary building is completed. Right. And then, and then even like to build a courthouse, it's an anticipated time of two years, correct? Because didn't they run into some kind of roadblock just recently? Not that we're aware of. Okay. Well, I mean... It's okay, but I'm just looking at, like, you know, because in case, like, and, and Deanna, so the next administration would be the 
um, the administration that would approve to, to get a bond float for this construction money, correct? Um, no, I don't know how long the design will take, so I'm not sure of that timeline. No, but I can't it, say it, for it, sure it would be the next administration. It could still be this administration. Right. But, it, but it could be maybe the next administration, right? It could be. It may be. Okay, I thank don't you. know. Okay, thank you. Any other council members wish to comment? Then I'll go ahead and um, call for the vote. All in favor, please say aye. Aye. There, one opposed? Okay, I have uh, eight ayes and one no. Just to clarify for the record, the no would be? Mr. Onishi. Thank you. And so resolution 432 will move forward to council. 